But what exactly is a buffer overflow and why is it such a big deal? Let's have a look. A buffer is a chunk of memory set aside to temporarily store data. A buffer overflow occurs when a program writes more data into the buffer than it can actually hold. Say we have this buffer space of length 8, which means that we can only store up to 8 bytes into this memory. Adjacent to it, we can see another memory location that stores other program-related data, which must not be tampered with. We can see that the string test123 can easily fit inside our buffer. But what happens when we try to store something into the buffer which is larger than 8 bytes? We overflow into the next memory location. So basically the data that was here previously was overwritten by our input data, and that's the overflow. Here is where the danger comes in. If an attacker can control the overflow data, they can manipulate what gets written into memory. This can lead to all sorts of malicious outcomes, from crashing the program to executing arbitrary code.